So I was asked the question, Josh, how do you want to proof your RC truck? Whoops. Well, it's simple but complicated. Let's do it again. So what you have to do is you have to get two paper bags, and you have to cover the important electrical parts of your truck so they don't get damaged by any water. And as you can see, it works so far because my truck's pretty muddy. So, um. There's different ways you can do it. It's not just one way, but <coughs> sorry, you have to somehow get this paper bag to go on top of the engine to cover it, so water doesn't get in the vents here and damage your engine. And then with this bag, you just have to get it in the cracks here. It it is easier if you take off the truck body, but I'm I'm too lazy to do that. So then you're covering the battery and the circuit board. All you have to do is get the handles, stick it in the cracks, and tie them. So that's easier, but harder because you need small hands. Or you can take the truck body off. Here, there's, like I said, there's different ways to do it. You could put the um, handles on the wheel axle like I am doing here, since they're not exposed and covered by plastic. This makes sure it's tight enough that it won't rub against the wheel. Or you could kind of tie it in between the springs here. And well, all you really have to do is make sure it's tight enough so it doesn't get any of the electrical components wet. So that's how you waterproof your truck.